For many years, I didn't feel like I was privy to the voice of God. I didn't feel like he would talk to me. I felt like he would speak to my leaders or those who were more spiritual. They seemed to have this great relationship with God and I'd somehow wait for them to tell me what God is saying to me. But there's times when the leaders weren't around or there's just situations that I had to deal with in the moment and I had no idea what to do because I didn't know what God was saying in that moment. I've spent a lot of my Christian years wondering what God is really saying. What does he really want me to do? What does he think? What does he feel about the situation? And for many years that has left me frustrated. It has left me feeling like I'm trying to go it alone, trying to pursue this, this whole walk of salvation that they say is so narrow, so, so precise. And how, how do I know that I'm really making the trip? But I really learned what hearing God really was. I found this book called Hearing God, and it really outlines just what it means to actually hear God. And it was way simpler than I thought it was. And just this book has really changed my perspective about so much that I've thought the voice of God was. Um, I thought it was a, a great spiritual high you had to get to for God to actually speak to you, but I've learned how simple it was to just just even hear God through my own thoughts and on what what the difference is between my thoughts and his thoughts. And there is just so much that has been simplified. I feel like I'm God's child again. I'm Daniel Chen, and the Hearing God book has changed my life. Thank you.